Hey there, I'm your band director, Mr. Victor Wiley, and you're watching How to Survive Bandcamp 101. So, Rookie, you decided to join marching band. Are you ready to experience the greatest four years of your short life? Yeah! Wait, what do you mean short? Am I gonna die? Let's get started! During band camp, we will be learning our annual field show. We're going to spend every minute learning drill, memorizing music, and putting it all together to create an unforgettable performance that will be showcased at competitions across the state. Awesome! I'll wait the floor with those other loser bands. Hey, hey, hey! Marching band is a team effort. It's not just about you. Yeah, yeah. So, what else am I supposed to expect? This activity is a major time commitment. Aside from competitions, we will be marching in a number of parades this year and attending our fair share of hellish pep rallies. Oh, and we also perform at football games during halftime. Wow! We certainly have our work cut out for us. So, starting this year, we'll be holding band camp at a sports compound in the middle of the woods to focus exclusively on learning the show. Woohoo! I'm ready to party! Whoa there, rookie. Band camp isn't about to be a walk in the park. Rehearsals are long and grueling, and you'll want to use every bit of free time you have to recharge. Make sure you're getting plenty of rest and eat healthy foods that will give you energy. Don't just grab a Pop-Tart on your way out the door. Let's check in with some of the older students to see what you should bring with you to band camp. Okay, so what should I bring? Sunscreen and plenty of it. Water. Gotta stay hydrated. Comfortable clothes. And ladies don't dare think about showing up in flip-flops. Sneakers are a must. And snacks. Your music, your drill book, and your instrument, of course. I don't know what kind of idiot would come to band camp without the essentials. And that's just the beginning of my comprehensive list of what you should bring. The next item is a deodorant, please. A good attitude. Tampons. What's a tampon? Cut, cut, whoa, whoa, whoa. Time to learn about the marching band chain of command. And we're going to start at the very bottom with you, rookie. Yay! The lowest of the low, the bottom feeder. What? Oh, that sucks. Maybe, but you've only just begun your marching band career. Don't worry, you'll work your way to the top eventually. Huh. This here is a section leader, specifically your section leader. Every section has one. If you have any questions or concerns, this is the person you should go to first. Well, Samuel, uh, got any words of wisdom for us? Is he asleep? If you find your own section leader is incompetent, I want everyone to know that you can always come to me instead. Where the heck did you come from? A step above our talented section leaders is our band president. Bonjour. My name is Garth. I'm looking forward to a fantastic season with you. Let's all do our very best. All right. And here's our student conductor, drum major Cadence. Give us a salute, Cadence. Remember, she is not your mommy. She is not the maid. She is our drum major. While marching, you should always be looking to her for guidance. You should... You should check her out like she is the hottest thing on the field. Oh yeah, I'm all over that. Wait, what's happening here? Moving up the totem pole, we have the instructors, the assistant director, and last of all, me, the big kahuna himself. The chain of command is extremely important, so be sure to refer to it for all your petty day-to-day -day problems. Only come directly to me in the event of an emergency. What if the band room is on fire? Well, yes, yes, Rookie, that qualifies as an emergency. What if a sex offender- Moving on, moving on. Hey, what's going on? We're filming a video on how to survive band camp. Aw, oh, cool. Uh, hey, Mr. Wiley, sorry I'm late. Also, I kind of forgot my music. <sighs> now is a good time to talk about what not to do. This is Doug. Rookie, knowing what you've learned, can you tell me everything Doug is doing wrong? I got this. Let's see. He's late. He's wearing mandals, he brought a giant gallon of iced tea to practice instead of water, and he forgot his music. Huh, what a loser. What's wrong with drinking iced tea? <gasps> Should I have brought an energy drink instead? Excellent assessment, rookie. And worst of all, he came straight to me about forgetting his music instead of referring to the chain of command. 
Speaking of which, if you do happen to lose your music, come see me, the band librarian. I'll replace it for you. But it would be better for the both of us if you didn't lose your music in the first place. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I completely forgot to introduce our one and only Marion the Librarian. No surprise there. Anyways, the point is, forgetting your instrument or music is a heinous act, and so is being late to practice. Commit this to memory. Being on time is late. Being early is on time. Then what is being late? You don't want to know. Ooh. To all of you watching this, don't be a dog. Don't be a dog, and you'll be just fine. Then what am I supposed to do? So, how are you feeling, rookie? Excited? Confident? Yeah! I'm pumped! I wanted to be Van Camp already. Whoa, whoa, hold your horses. I've got one last thing for you. Advice from seasoned marching band veterans. Huh, I don't need their advice. They're not much older than me. Perhaps, but they certainly have more experience than you. They've been in the trenches and know what marching band is all about. So listen up and listen well to what they have to say. Fine. Treasure every moment. You're going to make a lot of great memories. Get good. Don't suck. Don't take the advice the upperclassmen give you personally. They're only trying to help. Got it? Make friends with someone who has a car, because I am sure as hell not driving you to practice. Mom said you had to! Peter, Peter, this is general band advice, not just advice for your brother. Most importantly, have fun! No, most importantly, put your best foot forward at all times and don't drag the rest of the band down with you. It might get tough sometimes. But keep your chin up. The hard work you put in will definitely pay off in the long run. Marching band is long and hard, but every bit of it is worth it in the end. You'll make tons of friends, and the ones you meet here will last you a lifetime. With that, it's time to wrap up. Best of luck to everybody. Enjoy the rest of your summer, and we'll see you at band camp. Peter, what's a you, tampon? It's a great idea. New Should recruits ask, are going Mom. to watch this for years to come. Nah, you don't need to ask her. Just Florida. make sure you bring loads of them. <laughs> Trust me, you'll need them. Okay. Oops, I accidentally hit record. And ladies, don't dare think about showing up in flip floops. Floops. Where do you wear flip floops on? Marching band practices can be long and hard and. <laughs> <laughs> Thomas, don't say the word. Mom Boner, one more time, I will shove you through the bell of your instrument. Is he asleep? That f***er. Cut!